More than a million acres of the Texas panhandle is scorched by wildfires. 1.1 million of those acres burned by the Smokehouse Creek fire alone. Last month, a Texas A&M Forest Service investigator said a power pole that was decayed at the base fell, sparking the Smokehouse Creek fire. But today, members of the investigative committee on the panhandle fires asked if there's something more deliberate that happened. Where it was chopped. It, it's, it, it appears it started at the base. It, it's, it, what it appeared to me is it, it's as if they remove the dirt and then they do these chopping and then once they're completed, they, they, it's some kind of wrap around that they, they wrap it with something. This line of questioning centered around a contractor for Excel Energy called Osmos, which inspects power poles. Was there anything else uh, marked on that pole, any tags or anything like that? Yes, it, there was, it was marked with an inspection tag. Committee members have not seen a report from Osmos regarding the downed power pole, although State Representative Todd Hunter suspects there is one. Osmos was also not at the meeting, although they did send a letter. They've said that in their letter that they can attend and they welcome the opportunity to discuss and if we got additional questions. So let's take them up on that offer and ask if they've got any uh, reports. Well, we, we will certainly do that, Mr. Hunter. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.